Hey everybody, um, we're back here. Uh, I am in my kitchen. As you can see, it is dark outside, but we gathered the acorns today from the red oak tree and um, did the flow test. And we came up with just about 50 acorns that are healthy and ready for stratification. It's that cooling process uh, red oaks need to go through. So white oaks don't need to go through it. Um, acorns, they're ready to, you can put them in the refrigerator um, in, a, in a damp um, paper towel and watch the root uh, come out and be ready to be planted or you can just plant them right away um, in some damp soil under some, uh, and then once they, once they sprout up, they can go into a whole lighting process and dark, but with red oaks, um, after the float test, uh, you take the ones that sunk down and we have to begin this like five month cooling process. I'm sure it's more scientific. But let's be honest, I'm in my kitchen wearing a duck camo hat, Max 5, Tracks and Sign, baby. Um, this is what it's going to be. It's not scientific, but I'm pretty sure it's going to work. So for five months, I'm going to keep partial, um, uh, the partial amount, let's call it 45 uh, acorns between three different bags in my refrigerator and the rest um, in these pots here. So what we did is... Here's about 50 something acorns and I'm going to do one in each of these pots here. And I put uh, tree and shrub soil, um, Scott's good stuff from uh, Lowe's, just one bag. And I didn't even use the whole thing. So I've got three bags here. I'm going to put, I don't know, somewhere around 15 acorns in each. And then I'm going to put the rest in the, um, in the, in the pots here, one in each and leave them both for five months, these three bags in the refrigerator. Um, and then I'm going to keep an eye on these. Obviously I can't with these pots, but, um, we'll, we'll see the roots come out and, and, uh, and maybe even sprout. I don't, I don't think that you want them to sprout yet. You just want them to root and then be planted in the spring. But, uh, here goes.